Walk in an area like this one and chances are you or your dog could pick up a black-legged tick or two. Find it quickly, use some tweezers to pick it off, and you're probably good. But if you miss one on yourself, and they are really tiny and really hard to spot, there's a chance you could get Lyme disease, which if left undiagnosed and untreated, could lead to debilitating heart, joint, and nervous system symptoms. Now that's serious stuff, but here's the odd thing. You can get your dog vaccinated for Lyme disease, but you yourself can't get vaccinated for Lyme disease. And that's because there are currently no vaccines approved for human use. But there is, however, some news on that front. There is a phase three clinical trial underway for a new Lyme vaccine, a collaboration between the European firm Valneva and pharmaceutical giant Pfizer, the same company that brought us one of the COVID-19 vaccines. More than 9,000 people are taking part in the clinical trials in the US, in Europe and in Canada, including dozens here in Nova Scotia. I think it could be really a game changer for how we try to deal with Lyme uh, infection. So some of the, the difficult things about Lyme disease are that the ticks are extremely small, especially in their first year. You know, we'll say, why didn't you see that tick? Well, 50% of people with Lyme don't recall a tick bite. And that's because they, they don't, it doesn't hurt when you're getting bitten. It's not itchy immediately. And they're just very, very tiny. You know, wearing long sleeve clothing, different kinds of chemicals on your skin, that is a lot of work. It would be really great if we could be a little more carefree in the woods and just walking around our environment. A Pfizer spokesperson said, if the clinical trials are successful, then the company could potentially seek US and European approvals as soon as next year. There is no timeline for an application to Health Canada. I spoke with two Nova Scotians who were part of the clinical trials. Both participants know people who have contracted Lyme disease in one case, multiple times. Recorded cases of Lyme disease are rising in Canada and many more go unreported. In the US, one study found nearly half a million people a year may get Lyme disease. Meanwhile, tick numbers here in Nova Scotia are going up. Richard Cuthbertson, CBC News, Purcell's Cove, Nova Scotia.